Enter the Stars, Game of Thrones, Rise of the Blue Bloods. What am I talking about? This is the fleet in the first episode of the seventh season of Game of Thrones. And this fleet, as you can see, is all about the squid. What is up with the squid? The squid are the blues. They contain the copper-rich protein hemocyanin, cyan being the blue. And this is the crystalline structure of the blue blood, the copper-based blood. And as you can see within it, the seal, unbelievable. Now, what is going on with the hemocyanin super family? Well, many animals have this blue blood, including spiders, crabs, scorpions. This is the component in the blood of these animals similar to hemoglobin. The red blood cells, except these are the blue ones instead and this is why God had Moses erect a bronze serpent on a pole for the Israelites because God was reminding them that the blue blood is what they had to look forward to if they were to return to Egypt because they were complaining bronze is 88 percent copper in case you didn't know this was all about the blue bloods versus the red bloods. This is the difference between us. Copper based blood or iron based blood. Now this is interesting because it has been noted that its species using hemocyanin for oxygen transportation including crustate include crustaceans living in cold environments with low oxygen pressure. Under these circumstances, hemoglobin oxygen transportation is less efficient than, than hemocyanin oxygen transportation. So it's an efficiency of very cold environments. And winter is coming in Game of Thrones. That's why you see the blue White Walkers. They are blue. They are the blue bloods and they represent pure evil. Take care and be safe, you guys.